giving obeisance to the Almighty God, to worship Him as the Lord who is always there, the Lord who liveth, the Lord who does not change, a God who does not change because of our situations. He just remaineth as God always. Let us raise our hands, we are going to worship the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You are far and Omega. We worship you, our Lord. You are worthy to be praised. For
worship you are the God Almighty you are the God who's always there Father in whatever you do Heavenly Father we see your mercy we see your grace Hallelujah. Your fundi of a court, your fundi of a holy sa hallelujah. At Chatumabona Mutsumo and Tawone, at Chatumabona Mutsumo Fano Nabone, Sunebona Sita Sia Mangata, Sunebaita Sia Kanukisa, Bonaborichi, the Christo, Bonaborina Murea Yeso, Baba Mutsumanga Caso Tesla Rutanganaso, Bonaborita Bakundi, your Bacaso Tesla Mutsumanga Tandra Nitasu, Bonaborita Baba Fereda, Riabadi Bu, and Akatola Namusi, Redibor Mutsumanga Bonabo Sumuru, your Christo Nazareta Babunara. Christo with your own Nerko no Tibori of Abaneva Mitsuango, Nigaso Mutsuanga Rishuana Boneva Chiriwena, Nigaso Christo Chibana Boneva Chiri Kundera, Vachiri Konisa, Ria Barenda, Yohova, Hallelujah, Ria Bakota. Blessed be unto the name of the Most High God. Father, we thank you. Father, we glorify your name. Father, we bless you. We surrender to you as the Lord and the God of our lives. We bless your mighty name. We bless your precious name. Kabarendu wa Yeso. Kabarendu wa Murena. Kabarendu wa Mureri. Kabarendu wa Mukunteri. Bayachira, Yehovah. Bayachira, Christo. Atiatu mubona nongabona. Yehovah, bayachira. Sunebo neba itasu ya mangata. Sunebo itasu ya kanukisa. Bonebo ni rungurura ya Yehovah. Chago ni la suibi. Bonebo ni rungurura ya Yehovah. Rabasune rabasone. Baba musimu wanga rezojimaya na musinga. Uribona Yehovah banarine. Ria baribu wa riribu wa mbona ya mbona bukati andwei. Riri wa yofa sune wa kweita bukati ya machiru washu. Riri wa takulu wanga mbona, riri wa rengulu wanga mbona. Hallelujah. Father, we give you praise. Father, we give you the glory. Father, we worship you. We adore your holy name. We bless you as our God. We bless you as the king. You are the alpha. You are the omega. The first and the last. The beginning and the end. The almighty God. There is no God like you. There is no God like you, Jehovah. Baba ria barosha, yofa ria bakoda. Atia tumo bono nonga bono yehova ria bari bua yeso. Mutsu mwanga ria barenda yofa ria bahudisa. Baba ndi ari bua yofa ndi ari bua. Ndi ni bosi nubo neba kweita ngatsula iso kreso. Father we give you the praise, Lord we give you the glory. Father we worship you, Father we adore you. Father we bless you, we honor you as the Lord and the King of our lives. The King of glory, the I am that I am, the Lord who was, the Lord who is and the Lord who is still to come. Blessed be unto the name of the Most High God. Ria ni bua yeso. Riri wa mferezi so, riri wa kundo, riri wa mferezi wa riri wa chanda chabu nta machiru asu. Riri wa mferezi so ya bune nta machiru asu ya ufari ya barosha. Ya ufari ya bakota, riri wa mtsi mwanga kundo. Lebo neba lebe ya machiru ni asu ya ufari ya ima. Ya ufari ya bona tzamkara, babari ya ima raita asu neba neba funa. Arengari chuba renda, arengari chuba kundera, arengari ichi mtsi mwanga wa mba shibuya. Asu neba neba kweta machiru ni asu ya badibu wa kristo. Blessed be unto the name of the Lord. Father, we give you the praise. Father, we give you all the glory. We worship your holy name. Father, we bless your holy name. Mutsi mwanga ria barosha yo faria bakonda. Mutsi mwanga ria ba uri sanga uri bone bote wanga uri siwa. So tesu neba ita mutsi mwanga ndinga uri yenu bona zo fanera. Mutsi mwanga bosi bona zo rutoko no fuka kristo. Baba mutsi mwanga bone bosi ita ngo tibor na mutsi mwanga ringa si pareriwe. Yo fariri bonga uri nana muser katikona ar katikono hima. Yo va mutsi mwanga rito hima yo hofa kristo wa nazareta. Ramba subu ya mutsi mwanga shakundo. Mutsi mwanga sinu bone wako si ita machiru ni ashu. Ngatina le magata wala mbrona iso kristo wa chirao. Ria badibu wa kose, ria badibu wa mureni. Sina la mtsi mga li rendiwe, sina la mtsi mga li kotiwe. Father, we give you the praise, Lord. We give you all the praise, Lord. We worship thy mighty precious name. Father, we give you the praise. We give you the glory. We love you as our Lord and our God. We love you as our King. Your majesty, the I am that I am. The one who was, the one who is, the one who is still to come. Blessed be unto the name of the Lord. Ria barosha yeso, ria bakota kristo. Sina la mtsi mga le rendiwe, sina la mtsi mga le kodeo. We give you all the praise, Lord. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Ha kiliche, kilimovi, kilia, he.
praise Lord. Yeah, I give you that glory, Father. What a God I serve, what a God I worship. What an awaka my achina. Yova mana mamurena, yova my kanukisa. Yova wama wuti, yova wana kesa. Sinalam simukali radi walu kotiwe. Father, we give you the praise, Lord. Oh God, we give you all the glory. Oh God, we worship your holy name. Blessed be unto the name of the Lord. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory be unto God in the highest. We give you the praise, Jesus. Can you shout and you scream and glorify the name of the Lord? Yay! Yay! We give you the praise, Lord. We give you all the glory, Father. Oh, blessed be unto the name of the Lord. Hallelujah to the name of the King. Oh, no.
Jesus Christ. I would like to tell you about the sicknesses that I had. I started being sick on the 24th of June. I was unable to urinate and to go to the toilet to excrete. And then on, on the 21st of July, I was bedridden. I went to the hospital. They, they said to me that they are not seeing anything. And then on the 23rd, on the 23rd of, July, of July, my sister phoned me from Malamlele. Malamlela. I go to Malamlela. Malamlela. go to I came here. I was sitting somewhere that side because I was very, very sick. Apostle prayed for me. Ever since then, I am healed until today. I praise God. Amen. I greet you all in the name of Jesus. I'm Caroline from Zimbabwe. I want to thank God because I was here on the 23rd of last month. I was sick of ulcer and tonsils. I was here as a visitor and the pastor prayed for me. And he said unto me that I'm free of all that is bothering me. Ever since that day I'm healed, I thank God. I would also like to thank God again. My husband was working in Kuwait and Dubai. 
Even when he was working, there was nothing to write home about. Now he was working in Kazakhstan. He came back yesterday with a certificate showing that he can employed, be employed by any company. I'm, I'm happy that he's also here as I'm speaking and I thank God for that. Amen. I thank God for all this. I greet you all in the name of Jesus. Even me, I would like to thank God for what he has done for me. I was HIV positive, ALSA and all these things. Uh, Apostle prayed for me. All the sicknesses, they are now gone from my body. And now I'm HIV negative. Amen. On the 25th of July, I came here for the first time. Men of God, Papa Mr. Rokana and Nisa, was talking to the congregation, say, count three days. Day one is bad news, day two bad news, but come day three, you hear good news. My apostle, I have a lot of people who are going to be able to get rid of And on day three, indeed, from a dry five years working for the company with no increase, but they call me and tell me that they're giving me increase. Amen. 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 So I will just want to thank God for clearing all my faith. Thank you. Amen. I greet you all in the name of Jesus. This is my second time of coming here. The first time I came here, the first thing that I was looking for was anointing water. I only had 30 rand telling myself that the water is 10 rand. So, then I just decided to buy the water with my last money. This water worked for me when I got home. We drank both me and my wife and with our daughter. And the remaining water we cooked with it. So surprisingly, I was smoking. Since that day, Sunday of it has now I think Ever since I used this water, I have not smoked at all. I'm owning a catering and construction company. Ever since this year, I never got any project. But since Sunday, ever since I came here on Sunday, on Thursday, they called me on Thursday to come and cater the city of Jobek for 292 people. For 292 people, I thank the God of Jehovah. Amen. I greet you in the name of Jesus Christ. I'm Anna from Free State. The first time I came here, I was sick. I had a moving object inside of me. I also had migraine. Okay. I've tried all kinds of tablets, but I was not becoming better. 
this thing that was moving inside of me in the lungs I would vomit until the doctors would ask me if I'm smoking then I found out about Charis Missionary Church then I came here Apostle prayed for me and he said you are healed then I was healed the second testimony on the 17th of July it was at night I had an attack. I didn't know what happened unless except for what my husband told me that night. I couldn't talk. I couldn't open my eyes. I was very, very, very weak. The whole night my husband took my hand to the screen of Charles TV when Apostle was praying and he was also giving me anointing water until morning I couldn't open my eyes he took me to the doctor ever since then my life was protected by the anointing water because even the doctor didn't know what was wrong with me I would like to thank God who protected my life by anointing water Jesus, uh, can, can you greet your neighbor? Say you are blessed. Hallelujah. Amen. You know, when God do things, you will never understand. Uh, I, I've been checking for how God does things. I can't find the formula. You know, he's God. Creator of heaven and earth. I've been checking, I found that he can use useless people like us to bless other people to be a blessing to other people. This God is amazing. Taking nothing, nothing to be something. That's what you'll be doing on you today. Sometimes he allow your situation to be above your power. To prove those who think they are wise. That they are stupid. So, whatever that has happened to you, from now on, glorify God. I want you to hear today. God was telling me this message. Tell my people, as I've promised, they won't die, they will see. Tell your neighbor. If you know this is God's promise in your life, come rain or sunshine, you won't die until you have that promise. Now, I want to share with you something. So, this is our message today. He promised me. I saw it. Even if you try to kill me, I won't die. I won't die because God spoke. The Bible says his word will remain. 
Heaven and earth can even go. But his way shall come to pass. So if you are here, if you believe that there is a promise of God in your life, don't look at what the devil is doing. Don't even look at them. Laugh at the tricks of the enemy. Because it's going to come to pass in your life. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. I thought you are you are, you are writing. <laughs> I thought because I'm preaching. You, I'm busy preaching now. I thought you are writing. Oh, you want me to, to preach the whole Bible? I'm preaching what God told me. That whether you are people oppose you or not, you are going to be my witness. You are going to be my witness. Try to kill you or not. You are going to be my if God gave you a promise, like what He did on you, He said, Can you see? It will happen in your time. Can you see? This is the building you build. This is the building you build. Can you see? This is what you have. Can you see? How I many of you believe that God is speaking with you? If He's speaking with you, write those promises. Don't doubt them. Don't look at anybody. You are, you are here for yourself. Tell somebody to say, sit with your stories. I'm, I'm here with, for myself. Can you tell anybody again? Sit with your stories. I came here alone. Hallelujah. Amen. Let, let's bring the proof we share this. Uh, this, God says our message today. What I was hearing, God was saying to me, you have to be fulfilled. You must be what? Fulfilled. Are you fulfilled? Are you fulfilled? In your life. Say no. Because what you are searching, has not yet come. I saw it. Huh? So you can't die until it comes. I'm sure now you understand the message. This is the introduction of the <laughs> message <laughs> that I give you by what was happening when God told me. If you read John 3, and we read from verse 25 to 30. John what? John 3. From 25 to 30. Therefore, there arose a controversy between some of John's disciples and a Jew in regard to purification. So they came, is verse 26, to John and reported him, Rabbi, the man who was with you on the other side of the Jordan and to whom you yourself you yourself have borne testimony notice. Here is baptizing too. And everybody is flocking to him. Can you see the verse there? Amen. 27. John answered, A man can receive nothing. That verse, I love that thing. Get out of the Except as it has been granted to him from heaven. John you yourselves are my witnesses. Is John telling them? He said, you are my witnesses. You personally bear me out that I stated I'm not the Christ, the anointed one, the Messiah, but I have only been sent before him and then in advance of him to be his appointed forerunner, his messenger or his announcer. Lena peng lidi chachi, cheki di bulicheo kare, na sin na kreste, 
kare ke morumi wa wa go moetra pele if you read verse 30 he said ali go verse 30 ire he must increase but i must decrease yena ke wa hola na ke wa go kokobela let's pray for the thank you for your word in jesus name amen amen talk about today that's what we want to talk about taba ye ke re rata go bolela ka yona le khonole to be fulfilled oh khotsofala wa khotsofatsa bophelong if you can read here you see john ha le bala botse mo le to thola john john did what many of us cannot do john o dire le nto e paletseng ba bantsi ba rena ba ire ka se gone go itira if somebody come and say a motho mo akata go lena re you have help that one now it is better than you jonong motho la o ka one go fita you will be offended o atine o ba wa khopishe the bible says the the disciples came out bible re ba roti wa ba tswela pepeneng go re ba thailela and come to john ba tla go johan and say john are johan we want you baptize o la o mo kolobiditse and the one you spoke about o la o nkile wa bolela ka yena is baptizing many people ashule than you o kolobetsa batho ba bantshintshi ba ufita ba gao and i mean everybody is flocking to him motho ka o fela e bile o kiti ma yana ke uwe go yena the answer that john gave was petule jo gana e tileng le yona she nothing men can receive a go motho a ka amogelang se sengwe is not given from above if into we asa e fiwa o thale o dimo there is nothing you can receive you ka yamogelago if you are not given from above a wena nto we o sa e fiwa o thale o dimo john could not compete Jona Johanne haipa pecha he was fulfilled o ila kwa khotsofetse he was satisfied o ila kwa ena khotsofetse when he here he said hai kwa tsa pache are my job that i did mere ko nna ke u dira go announce him ne u ita fela ka bolela ka yena and i told you i'm not messiah na ke le buditse ka rena si yena messiah that one is messiah o la ke yena messiah John was fulfilled. John we la go to fala. I have done my work. Are na ke di ile se ne ke tsontsho se dira. My work was to announce him. Mo shumwa ka ne le o takata ka bolela ka yena. Look here. If you read there you realize. A o bala mo lo to le mo age gore. This was a temptation. O re taba ye ne le tiko ya John. John was supposed to have competed. John na tsontsho ba ha ipapeditse le Christ Jesus. The disciples came. Ba ruti wa ba tile. Like they are try to make John to be away. Ba le ka o tsibisha John o ra tsibe. There are many people who are coming to you. Bona le batho ba ntshe ba tang go lena. They are bringing awareness. O ka re ba dia o re le le moge. And you end up having some characters. And when I go fell it on a le me khwanya na e mengwe. And even thoughts. Le me na go no e me bi. Ya go ipa live your life. E bile wa sapallo wa palo ka pila bo pilo ba gao because if john le ba ka shele if johane man have said na nka be motho mo aitse why jesus is doing that why jesus what dira di lotse it means john was not fulfilled ora uri john na ta ba sa khotsofana but because he was fulfilled mara ka le ba ka la uri na khotsofetse uri ha bolela he must increase ye no tsontsho ra oke tsho ba gule and i must decrease na e ke kokobale in other words ka mantshe ma ngwe He said I don't compete. Ore na ke papetse ye na motho. Na ke phila ba ka bophilo. And I have finished my race. Ene ka na ke feditse ka tsela ye ne ke ikitima. He spoke like Paul. A bolela a swana le Paulo a re. I have lived my life. Na ke phitse bophilo ba ka. And I have finished my race. E bi le ke feditse o kitima le ba ka la ka. I'm here to tell you that. Na ke mo to le botsa le na hore ba bantshi ba rena. We are not fulfilled. A re a khotsofala. We end up competing wrong people. Re feleletsa re ipapetsa le batho ba seng bo. You can be excited. When you see somebody you have helped, becoming better than you. If you are, if you are fulfilled, if that help was fulfilled. But you can be annoyed. If truly you have helped someone can it will let what you have to move we can better than you motola thomo ba ka no ufita wena listen tele tsang mana ba papa everybody who's fulfilled motho ka ofela ya khotsofetseng he can compete ha i papetse le motho mongwe when you are fulfilled you can how khotsofetse a wi papetse le motho you accept it as it is wa amogela ditaba tsa go dile ka mogodi le ka ona ke ona ya mathoma wi papetse le motho you can compete a wi papetse le motho he who's fulfilled you are khotsofetseng number 2 sabobedi he knows the purpose of his life o ya tsebori ena morero wa ga ile fasengkeng 
Listen to this. Once you know your purpose in life, I will tell you, you can even know when your ministry is finished or when your business is finished or when your life is finished. You know, you remember John when he was in prison? When John was in prison, he said, go and ask these people. Ask Jesus if he's the Messiah or not. You know what Jesus, John was asking? John wanted to find out if he is finished or not. Because he knew he's supposed to present Jesus. When Jesus answered the disciples question John, they spoke about the issue of John's ministry that is finished. He, he said, said the blind can see. It's no longer an issue of water. The water is finished. The blind can see. The lame can walk. He was trying to tell John that John, you have done it. When they departed, Jesus spoke about him. He said, when you go out, what is it that you saw? What is it that you saw? You saw a prophet. No, no, no. It's more than a prophet. Hallelujah. Amen. So what is it that you saw? Did you see a king? No, 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 no. He was not a king by the clothes. He was wearing clothes. He was wearing. He was not showing comfort. But this man did his job. And Jesus said, because he did his job, he he is more than the prophets of old. But he said, the least in the kingdom can be better than him. Why Jesus said that? Jesus said that because when you are in the kingdom, you get assignment of the kingdom and you are fulfilled in the kingdom because there is someone who died for that kingdom. So you don't die, to There are some people here that when we look at their lives, they are not fulfilled. And there is nothing that can satisfy them. The reason why you cannot be satisfied is because you are not living your life. We need Christians today that can go back and be restored and they begin to live their life. Such people they will be fulfilled. You find that they've got small things but they are happy. You find that they've got small progress but they are happy. Because happiness of whatever small you are encountering tells you that the bigger thing is coming. There are Christians here today that God is lifting them up and is raising them up. You are going to be fulfilled from today. Serving God being fulfilled. Worshipping God being fulfilled. Hallelujah. Praise Jesus. That's what I say, my friend. Are you fulfilled? If it was me and I'm hearing there's a man of God there. I mean, the church is so big. You are not I can't speak like this. I'll say, who is he? 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 Who is why? Because Why? I'm not fulfilled. But he was fulfilled. He will say, as long as I'm here, as long as where God planted me, I don't care what is happening around. I'm happy of where I am. I don't know if you're hearing me. As I say, are you fulfilled when you are in Charis? Because there are Christians who are in Charis who are not supposed to be here. So let's look at the fulfillment of Jesus. If you read John 10, from verse 17 to 18, Jesus said, John 10, 17 to 18, my father loved me because I laid down my life. I have power to take it. No man can take it from me. And this is the commandment of my father. Jesus was talking about his fulfillment. He says, for me to die on the cross, no one has killed me. I'm the one who's taking my life. Think about 
the cross. When you remember, the, the Bible talks about when Jesus was going to Jerusalem, when Peter said, please, if they are going to do that to you, please turn back. Jesus said, get behind me, Satan. Because it excites Jesus to be fulfilled in the commandment of his father. Can I say it again? It makes Jesus to be so Jesus. happy when he fulfilled the commandment of his father. He becomes fulfilled whether he is going to die or not, whether he is pain or not. If you can read it, you realize that Jesus was talking about his death but he was not so bothered. He said, no one is killing me. When he saw Judas coming, he says, there comes my friend. He talked Judas as a friend. Why? Because he knew what he was doing. He understand that he is fulfilling and he is part of fulfillment. If he died on the cross, he won't die forever there. He knows his father. And he said, he has got power to take again his life. Listen to this. Many of your enemies are there to fulfill your life. They are not there to destroy you. Whatever you are seeing in your life, don't worry about it. It's part of fulfilling your life. Your enemies can become friends. When they are holding you, you are holding Jesus. When they are holding you, you are holding your destiny. When they are blocking you, you are running to the end. We need Christians who can be like this man who gave us the example Jesus Christ of Nazareth. And he say, okay, you see what? I lay down my life and I will take it. I've got power to do it. And this is the commandment of my father. It excites me to do that. It is true that Jesus prayed prayer of showing that he's not happy like yourself. There are some situations that does not make you happy. When you look at them, you cannot be happy when you are praying. But such situations are working to the fulfillment in your life. That's why I want to be fulfilled. You know, there's something that I wanted to tell you before I continue. You know when you are called for something like me. When you are called for something. You don't care. You can be poor, you don't care. You can be sick, sick you don't care. You can be tough, you don't care. You carry out to execute what you are created for. Because you won't be fulfilled. You, you can pretend to do something which you are not. When God was telling me about this, I began to remember how many people are doing business who are supposed to be business people. Sometimes we copy other people because we see them prospering on what they do. And we are not fulfilled there. We are not happy there. We are just trying because we saw other people doing it. When my wife went to university, she was studying something called chemistry. So, on that year, I saw many, many students of chemistry. And this chemistry was a new thing. And, and by then, it was giving a job. People went there because they wanted opportunities. But it was not the issue of their fulfillment. It's as good as pastoring. There are pastors who are very, very rich. Many people are becoming pastors because they saw those pastors. But if they are not fulfilled, they are just there because they saw others doing it and they make it. That's what I'm afraid. I believe you have got an assignment in your life. It must be known. I'm here to announce you as John announced Jesus for your assignment in life so that you know you are not created for zero and you are going to make it in the name of Jesus. If you believe, shout hallelujah. So Jesus didn't care 
And even when they're trying to say, are you seen or did you did, did wrong or whatever? He, he, didn't didn't he was ready to die. When Pilate said, Talk the truth. He was. He was just saying, "I know." After this, I know because he who is fulfilled. If your life is centered to Jesus, you begin to understand what will happen in your life. So you won't be bothered. There are certain things you won't pray about. But you know very well that you need to go through this. Go through this. But at the end, you are conquered. I don't know if you are hearing me. There are some people here you are born in a poor family. It's tough. It's like you are lowering your life. It's like your life has been lowered. But after this service, you are going to be fulfilled from that. The excitement will come upon you and you will live a better life from today. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Look what Jesus said here. In John 19 verse 28 there. Let's go and read there. When Jesus said, no one take my life. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I say John what? 19. 1928. I want us to read that because I think it's important for us here. Can I read that? Can I read that? Can I say verse what? 28. We'll read to 30. Eh? Let me read. Let me read. Let me read. Let me read. After this, Jesus, knowing that all was now finished, ended, said, in fulfillment of the scripture, I thirst. Look there. Verse 30. When Jesus had received the sore wine, he said, sour wine, he said, it is finished. And he bowed his head and gave up his spirit. I want you to understand what we have read there. Jesus said he laid down his life. And Jesus was fulfilled because he knew his purpose. Why he came. Why at the He knew that he came to die. But he also understood that no one can kill him. Yeah, that scripture of 28. Is telling us that Jesus checked everything they did on him. And he realized that there is one thing left. Which is written in the Bible. It was a sour wine. Are you hearing that? Amen. And he said, Are. when he realized that oh, everything is finished, now, and he's supposed to say he wants to go now, he said, Okay, Are. now I thirst. They took that wine. The moment they give him, he said, It means they've got nothing to do with it. What Jesus was announcing there. He was saying, I knew what they would do on me. But the last thing is that so, so why. So now, all, all the things they crucified, they put him there, they cast him, they spit on him, other working their heads. And I mean, Jesus is supposed to come out from his body and go. But when you look at them, he said, ah, they did all this except that wine. So let me tell them now. And he said, hey, I first, they took that vinegar and they bring it with a sponge. And he said, oh, now it means I'm supposed to go. These people, if I hang here, I will, 
I will just hang here forever. Anka no lepella mo gitano lepella na ko ya baya sipila ya anchi sipila. So from the after he take it. So kama rawara anwe be iniela. The Bible says he breathed his life. Bible re ahe malama felelo. And he went to heaven. Aniela mo. Hallelujah. Amen. You know Christians were supposed to be reaching that level. Let's baba police on the road to fit harla se mongse. There is something that the enemy can do on you. When I lintu le na ba le ka idia ngwe na. But he must reach somewhere. Your enemy must reach somewhere. Where you find that he can't do more. He can reach you, cripple you, whatever, whatever. But there is something he can do. And the moment you reach that level, they can't do anything. Not that they finished what they were trying to do. It is your time to rise up. I don't know if you are hearing that. Your enemy can do whatever. They can beat you. They can criticize you. Lie about you. And say whatever. Yourself you must be fulfilled with when joy. You are knowing that you are there. For a appointed time. And the fulfillment time when it comes. When the enemy can do anything. When the enemy say I am finished. I apply everything. I use all formulas to destroy this person. That's where you can say, are you finished now? Are you finished now? When the enemy says, oh, there's nothing I can do. You say, oh, let me go. You go to another level. I prophesy some people. You have suffered enough. And you have struggled enough. My God says today. There is nothing that your enemy can do again. Move forward. Move forward. Don't die there. Move forward. Let them criticize you. You must laugh. You can feel the pressure and the pain they are giving you because they are trying to put something on your body. But there is something which will be the last one. It's what they did last night. From now on, there is nothing they can do on you. Pastor say, hey, what you have done is over. Now it's my turn to rise up. It is your turn to ascend. Pastor say, hey, it is my turn to ascend. Can you tell three people around you? It is my turn to ascend. To go up. I don't care what they have done. I'm forgetting the pain. I'm forgetting the sorrow. I'm forgetting the shame. I'm fulfilled. Oh, what they've done in my life. I don't look on what they've done. I'm carrying on. I'm carrying on. I ascend. I ascend. I see you in your career. You'll be fulfilled. You are ascending in your career. You won't die there. You will go up in your career. I see you ascending. I see you in death. When the enemy is trying to cripple you in death and you are complaining and you are worried and you don't have anything that you can do with money of paying your debt. But I'm seeing you ascending. Say I'm ascending. See now. Do la fast. I was learning this. I found that God sometimes gives your enemy chance to make a party. When they are busy dancing, are busy dancing, thinking they are dancing on top of you. They don't know there is something in you. 
that makes you to be fulfilled. What is that? Your God cannot lie. I say your God cannot lie. All promises are yes. And they are amen. You can look down like you are dying. But God's promise will make you to ascend. I see you ascending. I see you ascending. I see you ascending. I see you ascending. Say I'm ascending. Say I'm ascending. Say I'm ascending. Listen. Sometimes when you look at yourself, you forget the promises because the promises of God are the ones who make us to be fulfilled. There is a pain here, but the Bible says by his stripes I am fulfilled. There is poverty here, but the Bible says I will be blessed abundantly abundantly because Jesus gave me life abundantly and the blessings of the Lord makes me rich and I have no sorrow with it. So I won't look on what the devil is saying. I will look and to the promises of my father God he said he will never leave me or forsake me I will carry on looking and I will be fulfilled say hey yeah. hey Devil thought you'll be crying by what you are facing. Devil thought you'll be talking the situation you are facing. But you don't talk. You look unto the promises of the one who gave the promises. Because he's not like a man. He cannot change his mind. Today, I see you ascending. Say I'm 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 Some people thought you, you might be dead by now. They thought you might be dead. But they will be surprised. Some people thought you will lose the job. But they will be surprised. Yeah. Some people thought your husband or your wife will leave you. But they will be surprised. You are. Say, hey! I'm fulfilled. Say I'm fulfilled. I'm not looking back. I'm fulfilled. I might not be having money, but I've got my God. I'm fulfilled. I might be having rejection from people, but I'm not alone. I'm fulfilled. They might be fighting me, but I don't care. I'm fulfilled. They might be blocking me. I don't mind. I'm fulfilled. They might be gossiping me. I'm not hearing them. I hear the promises. If you believe, shout The joy I have. You won't take it from me. The joy I have. You won't take it from me. When they are talking, I'm feeling pain. The pain is in the flesh. But inside me, the joy I have. You know, you 
there are times when you reach a level. You begin to say, ah, but I'm working forward. Even this job is not producing anything. Not that, that time when you're talking. The enemy says, ah, I thought this guy, you will quit the job. You know what you do? Deep down, change what you are saying. And say, hey, I will get out here. Not because somebody wants me to get out. Jesus on the cross, he said they can't kill me. So they have done what they have done. Now it's over. It is my time. There are some people here. You are oppressed, pressed. And the situation is amounting. The trouble is everywhere. I'm here to tell you. Nobody can do anything to you. They, can, they have tried. And it's over. It is your time. I say it is your time. Ascend. Anamela. To a better life. Ascend. Ascend. To a promotion. Ascend. To a better environment. Ascend. I see you. Laughing the best. Everybody around you. Facing down. Say, hey. Hey. When somebody asks you. How, how are you? Are you? Say, I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Glory to God. If you carry on this week, even your witches, they will come and confess. It's a week. Your enemies will confess. I said they will confess. How are you? How is your job? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? Why is like things are tough? They want to find out. The last bomb they throw. On you. That's why they say. That is why Babu What is happening with you? When you answer them. Wala. When you say wala. wala. They will say. Let's leave him. Let's leave her. It is your time. Voila. Say I'm fulfilled. Sit down. Hey. Arez. In the morning, somebody, you know, where you are staying, your neighbor, just say, Lika, how are you? Well, saying, how are you? Somebody will ask you where you are staying. How are you? Don't pretend. Like, <laughs> you didn't hear them. <laughs> they want to see their last bomb. <laughs> because because there is no other bomb they will throw <laughs> again. Show them. Show <laughs> them. <laughs> Ares. Ares. Let's read one scripture we close. Hey. If I tell you this, you won't understand this. Before we read there, when you know your purpose in life. And you are fulfilled because you know the promises. You can detect the day you will die. You can know that. Uh, you are not supposed to die. I have done my assignment. Now it's finished. If you read Joshua 24. Joshua 24 if you go there. Look how Joshua put the elders. All of them. As they come. When he put them there, if you read maybe verse 22, just go there, Joshua. 
Joshua what? Jesus. 24. Joshua 24. I want to speak with you before I close. Can you just read this verse 22? Then Joshua said to the people, you are witnesses against yourself that you have chosen the Lord to save him. And they said, we are witnesses. Amen. Can you, can you see that? Yeah. You see the verse there? Yeah, verse 29. 29. Look here. After this, after this, can you see verse there? 29. Yeah, 29. After this, Joshua, son of Nun, the servant of the Lord, died being 110 years old. Joshua was fulfilled in serving God. But he was seeing people still doubting. He called all of them. Come. Because he knew very well that his time was close. After he said all this, said, he died. I think I was telling you that you will never die until the promises of God are fulfilled in your life. So Joshua knew his time can I tell you another man look at Moses God said Moses Moshe we. take people to Canaan but one day when Moses was angry he beat the stone that he took with the stone and God said Moses now you can't reach there he knew he knew his mission was to reach there he knew. even when God changed he knew. God took him to the mountain and showed him Canaan can you see there can you see Canaan there so you won't take the people there and the Bible said he died and God buried him there you need to know that when life is finished on earth is when you are no longer worrying about anything. You are fulfilled. You have done all. Enjoy all. Eat all. And the promises came and real to your life. You will know God has done it for me. If you read in X. The last verse there, it talks about Paul. Listen, you you talk about Paul. He says, when Paul was arrested, his two years, he was staying in a house in Rome that that he rented. And people come freely to him. Is when he was finishing his two years. He was no longer going out to preach. He was a city. And people come to him. And within two years, Paul, Paul was glorified. He went to heaven. If your assignment on earth is small, you won't live long. And sometimes God put more plans in your heart here. Because he wants you to be fulfilled. Just think God that God can do it. It means you can live long. Because by the plans that God put in your heart, if truly you are happy about it, those plans, if for 30 years, when you are busy what you are doing, How doing busy what you are doing, busy you won't die. Even if you are busy, you won't die. You will carry on. Let me take you to, uh, to Isaiah, son of Amos. Look at the king that was sick. Isaiah 53. Isaiah 53. And the Bible says this king was told that, you see what? Isaiah 53. You won't wake up from the dead. The bed. And the Bible says he faced the world. Hezekiah. King Hezekiah. He faced the world. Hezekiah. He faced the world. Hezekiah. He faced the world. Hezekiah. Lord. remember how I've worked he remind God how he worked because he still want to walk and God changed his mind and said no 
God wants to bless you for their conviction. I say for their conviction. Don't worry about what has happened. It has happened so that they must talk. And they have been talking. But my God said it's enough. It is your time to it's your time to work. When you are going up, you will meet your enemy. They will be going down. I say you will meet your enemy. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. You are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to meet your enemy. You are going up. This week, you are about to promises will come to pass in your life. If you believe, shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. Shout hallelujah. I want us to pray this prayer. Because it is your time to go up. Tell them it is my time to go up. It is my time to go up. Can you just lift up your hand? Begin to thank God for the restoration He's giving you. Prayer, prayer. Thank God for the restoration. Oh, thank you, Father. My God, my creator. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Spirit of the Lord. Oh, carry on, Lord. carry on. Don't look at anybody. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. Carry on. Oh, Jesus. I'm fulfilled. Restoration. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Amen. When you are asking God for restoration, it's because you have already given up. 
There are some where you've given up. You must check uh, when you are a Christian. Many, many things will happen to you so that you give up. And giving up means you have given certain chance to carry on tormenting you. Satan is the tormentor. So from now on, when you are lifting up your hands, can you tell God where you want to be fulfilled? Prayer, where you want to be fulfilled. There's an area in your life where you want to be fulfilled. Thank you, Father. Carry on. Thank you, Jesus. Father, thank you. Thank you, Father God. Thank you, Creator. Thank you, the Lord of us. Thank you. Amen. speaking with me about you. It's tough now. Yes, it's it's tough. Because of the money you get, it's not even enough. It's not enough. It's not enough. But God told me that the expectation from your mom, where is your mom? It's in zone four. Zone four. God wants zone four. to bless your mom through you. Amen. So it is your cry. That's my cry. That's my cry. It's your cry. It's the second time he told me this. Now. And it has happened now. Amen. 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 God has loved you so much. Where is your husband? You don't have. Come here. Come here. It's a generational case. It's a generational case. Today, this case is breaking. You are free. Limitation in the family. Because you people here, you are hard workers, but things are tough. Eh? Huh? There is two men of God. So, who's working airport? That's me. You? Yes. Why are they not promoting you? Why are they not promoting you? Um, I started there February and then um, three months after they promoted me to another department. Yeah, they're and just moving you because yes. they're not giving you money. Yes. Eh? That is correct. The spirit of limitation is broken. You, you will think. Go, go, go. 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 You're free. You're free. So, husband, sister. Papa, okay. I don't know if. It's not only you, because it's something that is centered in the family. I say now I attend the school so I Huh? Yes. So you want to marry? What a Tom Marie? Yes. So who's Thomas? Tom. Dinya Thomas. Can I Tom? I don't know him. Because I see a man called Tom. The governor Mutu Novizo and Zinalel. In your uncle. 
kabo marume he was there but he has passed on what has killed him i don't know in your family there's this spirit of killing people and including Tom, including when you marry the husband must die or you get somebody but the last minute is the person will leave you you say what? It's true. So God loves you. You are delivered already. The spirit has left me. You are very sick. It's true. There are things moving in my body. You are coming here for the first time. Not the first time. No. Jesus has healed you. It's over for this. People are saying many things but about your family. Yeah? Yes, about But God says to me, I must tell you, don't take anything like that. Yes, yes, because this is dividing the family. Yes, uh? yes apostle. And, and your consent. And yes. Yes. always you question why this why like do this? you why do you come home because people are fighting each other yes, but go on to bless you you must unite the family but yes, you yes, and nobody can do anything to you yes. because i'm seeing you are going to have something like a transport business yes, 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 transport it's always you are thinking about it yes yes, yes, yes. so you are blessed amen This leg is giving you a problem. Huh? This one. It's true. Always when you walk, it's like it's pulling. You walk on top of a case. So it's broken today. This stomach of yours, this one, here, you always feel pain. Huh? It's true. You have vendor? Yes. It's like I'm speaking with vendors only. You saw that? Yes. Uh, give glory to Jesus. Uh, why is like I'm even afraid now. I'm afraid now. It's like God is sending me. Why vendors only today? Why vendor fella? So I've never spoke with you before. Concerning what? This pregnancy. So this pregnancy is not normal, but. There's no operation. Amen. Amen. Send me to you. Because of the situation of the family, I saw people in your family, they go up. Like yourself. But the, the way they come down to I zero, I never is painful. Like what is happening cheat. to you now? And that's so good. Your progress is dying. It's true. Huh? It's, true. Huh? it's true. Even where you're working, where are you working? Uh, government printings. But still, it's like you're just waking now. You are disappointed. But they are going to promote you. Take, take, take the power. Come on, come on. Come on. So God loves you. I saw, I saw a problem of thyroid. Thyroid. This thyroid. Yes. Huh? Yes, I've got a problem. This thing here. My lungs. It's coming up here, down here. Because when you sleep there, they give you something. Ah, you always sleep eating. Yes. Huh? yes, sir. It's true. And this thing is stopping your progress. It's like they're giving you this thing to stop you. Even now, there's no money. No progress, nothing. Huh? It's true. Huh? It's true. Dingo. So you're not there, eh? So you're afraid. Amen. I saw something that is happening to your eyes. You want into the yes. I can't hear you. Yeah, sometimes uh, I get eyes, yeah. some something like dizzy. Church finger the phone guard at Zunglu. My brother, I've never spoken with you before. Tetram Banavo. Sometime back. Huh? Sometime back. When was Church that? Finger Mara. Uh, two months ago. We were talking two about months ago. We were talking about. Um, Accident. Yes. But now I'm see your eyes here. 
Nikubona matovu. It's like you want to fold them. Ungare. Yeah. Since childhood I've been suffering with ice. Okay, yeah, you. Since childhood I've been suffering with Since ice. Since ndimo toko ndi natsa ya mata. Bigana. Sasa sina iko hold at ice ya one. Because you are becoming dizzy like you fall. Go ribad zunguru ungare matovu. Yes. Definitely. You are free. Yeah? And you're good. I saw you buying a car. I saw you buying a car, and I was looking at the car now. It's like a, this BMW. BMW. Three twenty-three. Three twenty-three. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank it's, you, Jesus. It's a dream car. Amen. 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 Are you working? You're not working. You're not working. God has given you a job. What you film merek? So Where were you staying before? I was staying with my wife. We separated. You separated. Yeah, because now where you are staying, you are just struggling now. I said, where you are staying now? It's a story. Yeah. Let me say it's a story. That's what I'm saying. Where you are staying now. That's why yeah. I said, where you were we staying before. It's yeah. a pain. What? what? What was the reason of your separation? We were always uh, fighting. My brother, if you are not delivered, even the lady you will marry, it will happen exactly. That's the reason I started coming to church. Huh? That's the reason I started coming to church. But, oh, you, you realize that you can't solve this. You need Jesus. A lot has happened. Huh? A lot has happened. So, your friends? Huh? We are partners. We are partners in, in a relationship. In a relationship? Yeah. These are we have part- babies together. Huh? We have babies together. We have a seven month, an eight month old daughter, and I'm pregnant again. And then, what about his wife? Um, we are separated. When? Mm. Uh, are, you not, are you not the cause of separation? No, I'm not. I saw when I was the separation. Along before I came in the picture. You came in the picture? <laughs> <laughs> My brother, here, yeah, there's no marriage here. Unless you are delivered. You hear me? Yeah. Yeah. You are still going to move from this lady. It's not because these ladies you are meeting are bad. Even this one of the picture. Yeah. Very soon you can live there with a picture. The truth is somebody curse you. This is the curse of your family. All of you people here from generation day. Yeah? Yeah. You have got the same problem. After I touch you, go and marry me. You hear me? Yeah. After I touch you, go and do what? Mary. Go and marry her. Huh? <laughs> I was going to marry her. I didn't say her. Okay. I said go and marry. I, I must go and ma- get married. You must go and marry. Amen. Okay. Amen. Okay. I saw something moving in your body, all over your body. Yeah, yeah this one. Huh? It's true. This one is true. Things are moving, moving all over. Yeah, that drinking blood on huh? my head. They're drinking blood on my head for something like four years. I can't, I can't hear you. Something is drinking blood in my head. How was your life before? Because I see you living a bad life. Yeah, um, huh? I didn't go to church before. I was just an ordinary person. So this thing started. So I went to stay at no, home. Let's not talk about church. Yeah. How was your life before? My life was fine before this thing started huh? happening. It was fine. It was fine. Right. Yeah. But now, what happened now? So why I don't know. When, when did Be careful happen? of ladies. 
Because this thing you've found it from one lady. So God loves you. You must be free today. From now on, when you are here, because you have got a spirit of lust. You love ladies. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've passed more than 200 girls in my life. You think I'm insulting you? He, he, he's a, he's a person of ladies. If you have got a church, his church will have only ladies. So he's free. More follow. You saw Satan is using temper on you. You are short temper. Now Please deliver me, Dad. You are short temper. Even now if somebody say sorry, sorry, you are becoming a sorry, 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 sorry. And this is not your character. And then to sit how you you are a very good person. After one brother hated you, huh? there's a brother who disappointed you. And after this brother disappointed you, every man now, it's true, every man now is a wrong man. They are using this to stop you so that you must not marry. And this demon is leaving you. Amen. Sharon. Huh? Sharon from where? Sharon from yeah. You must pray because in your family yeah. there's too much poverty. Yeah. Yes, men of God. Yes, men of God. It's true. You are trying to hold yourself, but things are tough. Yes, men of God. And you are, I think you're a real woman because you love to hide what is happening. Yes, but you are here for a family. The poverty is, is destroyed. Which church were you going? I can't hear you. It's worship city. There are so many churches that I went to before. Before. This man must be careful of tumor. Because there, there's something that is happening here. Inside, inside, even la, in your mouth. La yeah, la it's, la true. True. Eh? it's true. It's true. So Satan wants to destroy this man. Satan of no destroy. And everything about you is zero. You are always angry. angry. God, there's nothing moving. You've tried many things. I it's true, true. It's true. Yeah. It's true man of God. Even in the document of tenders, I will call you. You've got document of tenders. Uh. You've tried many things. I'm not it's saying anything. It's true. It's true. true. It's true. It's true. Uh. So God loves you. Uh, you are here for a blessing. Amen. Amen. You give us a testimony. Amen. You are free. You are here. Eh? Don't use these crunches again. Can you take the crunches? She, she must walk without these crunches. Rise up. Walk. Walk, mama. Come. Samayang. You are healed of arthritis. Arthritis. The problem is the spinal cord. Mama, you are free. In Jesus' name, walk. Carry on. walking. God loves you. God loves you. You I will speak with you today. Yes, yes men of God. Because God said, I must stand here. This lady, this lady, she always dreams service of God. Yes, yes men of God. God. That's true. And you are also dreaming Makananisa. Yes, yes men, men of God. Eh? True. So Makananisa is going to bless you today. So Makananisa, thank you, Jesus. She's a dreamer. She always dreams uh, all servants of God. Because I saw three servants of God, she's dreaming. So, she's free. Amen. 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 
God loves you. He's blessing both of you. Thanks, man of God. You know why I say he's blessing both of you? No. I saw a baby. I saw a baby coming. Thanks, man of God. Thanks, man of God. You don't want a baby? We we do. We do. We do. So, this lady doesn't want a baby. You want it. Yes, yes. Yes, man of God. Yes, true. Because I was very sick. I can't hear you. It's true. Because you were sick. Yes. So, now you are healed now. Yes, you have a baby. Yes, you have a baby. Yes, baby is coming. Amen. Thanks, man of God. Why you don't want a baby? Because you were sick. Yes, because I was sick. But now I'm healed. I mean. huh? Amen. 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 Hi, you are free. Look, look, God has blessed you with a job. You want a job, eh? I can't hear. Yes. Yes. There are some people who are here who are hearing the sound of my voice. I see God lifting their hands. I see, I'm seeing your situation changing. There's a problem with your breast here. There's a problem with your breast here. This thing can grow. Because sometimes you feel pain when you touch it. You feel it. God loves you. You are here. Where are you waking, Mama? I'm not waking. God has given you a job. see them because I see them being touched <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Don't clap hands. I want to see them even myself. <laughs> you are everywhere. <laughs> I see them being touched everywhere. All over this place. All over this chair. I see them even at the back there. Hey, hey, hey. I see them being touched Everywhere. 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 In this church. I see angels touching there. I saw somebody being touched there. I saw another one there. I see another one there. I see another one this side here. I see everywhere. 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 Hundred and seven tomorrow. Hundred and seven go son. Don't clap your hands. Don't clap your hands. Don't clap your hands. Just sit there. You will see them. You will literally see them. I saw those people running there. There, there. Yes, there. Somebody's touched there. I'll see them here now. Somebody's touched there at the back there. You people there. I'm seeing some, here, 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 here. You people here. Someone got a job here. There's a job that is coming to you here. I'm seeing everywhere now. Everywhere. Everywhere. Your testimony has come. Hey, 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 one or seven. This year, this one here. Yeah. They don't even reach 20. Yeah. Baba, Baba, 20. They 
There are still many sitting there. Father, show me all of them. Amen. There are so many. Others were wished. They were, they were wished so that they must never have anything in life. Others, they are in depth, depth, deep, in deep, 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 deep depths. But thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father. Bring all of them. All of them. Others, Amen. they are working wrong jobs. So they can't achieve anything. No so purpose in their life. They are not fulfilled. Father, show me all of them. Bring them out. Bring them out. That thing I'm telling you is happening everywhere. Where they are showing me everywhere in this place. Because oh, now I'm seeing, I'm seeing people here testifying cars now. I'm, they are here. Oh, Others, they don't have money enough to give that testimony. Of even buying a car. If a car will make your family to be saved, let it come. Let it come. If it's a house, let it come. If it's a business, let it come. If it's a healing, let it come. Father, can you show me such people? Amen. Show me all of them. These are uh, uh, Monday. Monday. This Monday. This Monday. Wherever you are, this Monday. Any demon that is blocking your miracle is running away from you. It's leaving you for good. There are others of this week, this week. The finances you are waiting for will never, never, never delay. Any delay this week is cancelled. It's cancelled. I say it's cancelled. Father, can you show me people have got delay? Amen. They've been waiting, it's enough. Can you just show me people that will give? testimony this week because the delay is broken. It's broken. It's broken. That delay is broken. The delay of finishing your house. The delay of getting your promotion. The delay of your healing. Of your healing. The delay in your life. The delay of your finances. The delay, the delay. You delay, you delay. Amen. You are defeated. 
You spirit of delay. Delay, delay, Uchanako. delay. Uchanako. In your family. It's coming out. It's coming out. It's coming out. Amen. The delay of starting a business. Uchanako. business. Delay of living your life. Uchanako. Delay of getting your house. Uchanako. Delay of getting your money. Uchanako. Delay of your healing. Uchanako. Delay because of debt. Uchanako. Delay. That delay. That delay. Uchanako. Is located. Is located. Is located. Is located. Is located. Is located. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Any generational curse in your family? Any curse where you were born? Is broken right now. Generational curse is broken. There are some people here, they have got generational curse. Curse of failure. Curse of disappointment. Curse of stagnation. Curse of opposition. Curse of being oppressed. Is destroyed wherever you are. That curse is located. It's broken in the mighty name of Jesus. It's broken. Curse of poverty. Any curse in your family. In your life. Is located. It's 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 located. Curse of barrenness. Curse of barrenness is located in your life. This year, you are going to be fruitful. You are going to be fruitful. Amen. Curse of witchcraft is broken. Nobody can do anything to you. Whoever tried to witch you will die. I say, will die. I say we'll die. Amen. If you are wished right now, whoever tried to do that, remember it's over. They've done what they've done. No more, no more. Whoever try you will die. I say we'll die. Amen. You know, listen to this. God loves people. We don't want them to die. But there are people who told themselves that they can rather die. Let them die. Because they love dying. Let them die. They must leave you. They must not temper with your life. They must die if they want to die. Die! Die! Amen. Can you all stand now? Holy Spirit, can you show me there are some people here who are living wrong life. It's not their life. Satan is stealing their finances. Stealing their joy. Stealing their peace. Can you locate them right now? They're like another one is down there. Can you locate them wherever they are? Wherever they are. Can you lift up your hands? It is your time for a testimony. Something is coming. Something is coming to you. You have lived the life you don't want. Listen, it's not good for you to compromise. No more compromising. No more compromising. No more compromising. As you are lifting your hands, I command whatever that has been planted on you to be uprooted. Amen. To be uprooted. Amen. So you spirit, say you spirit, you spirit, you are hiding in my life. You are hiding in my life. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Be uprooted. Come on. Come out. Come on. Out. Come on. Come out. Command that demon. Come on. Command that demon. Come out. 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 
Come out, 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 come out. Be uprooted. Come out. Out, 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 come out, come out, come out, come out, come out. Come out. Come out, 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 come out. Out, 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 out. Come out, come out, come out, come out, come out, come out, come out. Jesus, my children. Amen. The, the, listen, listen. Till later. Your life must come back to you. What you are created for. What you are born for. It has been stolen from you. It must come back to you. Today, today in the name of Jesus. I said today in the name of Jesus. Can you say, you hidden demon. You hidden demon. You are causing my failure. 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 Wherever you are. Wherever you are. I command you. I command you. To live my life. To live my life. Ow. I say ow. 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 Come on, come on, come on. Out, 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 out. Come on. Out, 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 out. Come out, 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 out. Out, 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 out. I can't hear you. I can't hear you. Come out, come out, come out, come out, come out, come out, come out. Out, 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 out. Yes, out, 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 out. I can't hear you. Come out, come out, come out, come out. I can't hear you. Come out. Out, 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 out. Come out, 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 come out. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let me ask this lady, you, about your husband. Yes, you, yes, yes. Where is the husband? Monawal Nauke. I. I don't even know where to start. You say what? We are not staying together. So. Uh, I don't want you to take any decision. Because I know you are tired. Yes, they were one night. The way Satan has entered him to trouble you. Don't take any decision. Just follow God. Follow God. God will deal with him. So that God will show you what will happen. There is something that God wants to show you what will happen. So the decision you will take, nobody will say anything about it. Because they, they have attacked the man God, to attack. attack you. So you are not happy. You want, so, to, you want to leave him because he left you. But God said, don't take any decision. Give it to God. When you give it to God, check within one month what will from now. God will fight for you. There is a when we are busy praying, my brother, the one I call, music. listen, my brother, the reason why I say I call you here, no, I didn't say anything. I wanted God to heal you. Because when you go to the doctors, they tell you a story of HIV. Huh? Amen. They say what? They say I'm HIV. HIV so, don't take that. It's a story. It's an attack. They come and attack you for this career. That's why I say you must play here. That's why There's no HIV on you. You are free. Say you demon. You demon. Wherever you are hiding. Wherever you are hiding. In my life. In my life. Say out. 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 Come on, come on, come on. Out, 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 out. Come out. Come on, that demon. Come out. Come out, come out, come out. Out, 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 out. 
Come on out, come 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 out. Out, 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 out. Come out, 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 come out. Out, 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 God has loved you so much. You, you, you are fighting the spirit of ascensors in your family there. Amen. Eh? Amen. You know what I'm talking about. Amen. And that is why you see church doing like this. It's like it's growing, but growing like because they want you to be discouraged. Amen. And they can't do anything to you. They just do everything you touch. They try to, to block it. Huh? Amen. So don't worry. From now on, as you are going to do deliverance, because, you are, because you are a deliverance minister. So you know you are a deliverance minister. So when you were fighting them underground there, they realize they have defeated by prayer. Yeah. So now they are trying to touch everything you are doing. You will see prosperity. You will see prosperity located. Receive power. Receive power. You are blessed. 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 This short pastor, this one, that one there, yes. That man, God, God wants to use it. Mighty. God wants to use you. But you must forget about the past. You, you have been hated by many people. Yes, yes, yes. Eh? yes, man of God. So, but always you can't trust people. It's true, man of God. Eh? It's true. So, the people you are having now, trust them. Trust them, just love them. Yes, man of God. Yes, it's true. The Bible says we must not trust people. In the Bible, we must not trust people. God wants to use you, sir. Yes, man of God. Remember what is happening in your hands. Yes, yes, it's true. Man yes, it's true. Sometimes you feel like there are things moving. Yes, here. it's true. Man of God. That is the power of God in your hands. It's true, man of God. Listen, Baba, nobody can stop that. I touch your chest there. Amen. Receive, receive anointing. Receive anointing. Receive anointing. Receive anointing. Receive anointing. You are anointed. You are anointed. Little DJ. What Amen. is happening to that Baba? It's oh. happening to this lady. The one who's looking back. Yes. It's not cramps. What you're hearing. Because sometimes you feel like it's cramps. Huh? My hands become painful. It's, it's, not, it's, it's not painful. 
you are hearing what we are hearing Amen. until you become used to it Amen. there is electricity Amen. that's what you are hearing Amen. Amen. what is your problem now can you just come to what is your problem huh? what is your problem now I feel what you're talking about. You feel. You feel all of you. So all of you are down here. Feel it. Feel it more. Feel it more. Feel it more. So wherever you are, so if you were denied and somewhere, they will open door for you. I say, if you were denied somewhere, they are going to open door for you right now. In the business, they are opening doors. In your job, they are opening doors. You know, how do we know that you are blessed? I want to tell you, I know. Because you are coming back with a testimony. I say, you are coming back with a testimony. Amen. I say you are coming back with a testimony. Amen. Receive your testimony. I receive. Receive your testimony. I receive. I saw something falling here. I asked why. Just like bow. I was asking myself. I said, oh. And then I God said I must locate it. Uh, so I'm going to locate it. It's falling on you. It's falling on you. No one can reach you and live love. Yeah. Yeah. I saw it here. Come I saw it on you also. I saw it on you. Take it, take it, take it. I saw it on you. I saw it on you. I saw it on you, all of you here. I saw it in all of you. I saw it in all of you. I saw it in all of you here. Hey, 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 take, take, take. All of, hey, you, you, take, take, take. I saw it on you here. Hey, 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 brother, you are falling down, eh? You are falling down. I'm seeing it there now. All of you here, you are anointed. You are anointed, all of you. Receive anointing. I, I see anointing on you. Take it. Amen. Take it. Amen. I see anointing where? Here. Can you receive anointing, you people here? I see anointing on these pastors here. Here, you people here. here. You people here are anointed. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, Akasika, ya. Hey, hey, Akas. Hey, Akarababashak. This pastor's here. Can you just look at this pastor's there? Hey, hey, you people here, you are not. Hey, 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 hey. Take it, take it, take it. Hey, brother, take it. You people, you are anointed here. Take, be he, be blessed, be blessed. Take it. I say you are anointed. You are anointed. Amen. You are anointed. I say if you are watching also you are anointed. Amen. I say you are anointed. Amen. You are anointed there. Amen. You are anointed. Take it. Take it. All of you here. Take. Take there. Take. You my visitors here you are anointed. Take. Amen. Take. Take it. All of you. Take. Take. You people here you are anointed. You are you are anointed. All of you here. Take. Amen. Take, 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 You 
You are anointed. You people, you are anointed. Some are anointed. I'm anointed. Some are anointed. I am anointed. Some are anointed. I am anointed. Can you lift up your right hand and wave it like this once? Anoint your face. Amen. Anoint your face. The curse is broken. Amen. I say your curse is broken. Amen. I say your curse is broken. Amen. I see you with a testimony. Amen. I see you with a testimony. Amen. I see you with it. Hey, Amen. There are people here. You are anointed. You people here. You are anointed. All of you here. Take, take it. 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 Uh-huh. You are anointed. Take it. Let go to each way. You are all anointed. You Let people Let there, you are anointed. Le na komara u kwale le todi chwe. There are some people here by anointing. You are receiving. You are anointed, my brother. God is making you a head. Where you are staying. No one will be able to compete you. No one will be able to stop you. I decree and I declare to you. Amen. That nobody will be able to stop you. No one will be able to block you. I say you are anointed. Amen. 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 Receive anointing. I receive. To prosper. Amen. To be blessed. Amen. To be the first. I receive. Receive. I receive. Wherever you are. Amen. When you live here. Monday Manta. will never pass without a test. Monday will never pass without a test. This Monday, we declare it a week Amen. of overtaking, taking Amen. over. Because whatever you are going to receive, it will make you number one. Say I'm number one I am number in my one family. In my family. Listen, you are not competing anybody in your family. You are receiving something different. Receive it in the name of Jesus. I receive. Receive it in the name of Jesus. I receive. Be blessed in the name of Jesus. I am blessed. Congratulations. Amen. Keep watching, Charis.